Welcome to eSIM Circle. Today, I'll show you how to set up your eSIM on an iPhone. There are two simple ways to do it, by scanning a QR code or by entering the details manually. Before we get started, make sure your iPhone supports eSIM, that your device is carrier unlocked, and that you have a stable internet connection, either through Wi-Fi or mobile data. Let's begin with the QR code method. Open settings, tap cellular or mobile data, and select add eSIM. From there, choose use QR code and scan the code we sent to your email. On the activate eSIM screen, tap continue and then done. You can even give your eSIM a label to stay organized. For example, eSIM circle, your destination. Next, you'll be asked to set some preferences. For your default line, choose primary. For iMessage and FaceTime, select your new eSIM and for cellular data, choose the new eSIM as well. To avoid extra charges, it's best to leave allow cellular data switching turned off. Once that's done, tap done and your eSIM is ready to go. If you'd like to install it manually instead, the process is just as straightforward. Go back to settings, open cellular or mobile data, and again select add eSIM, tap use QR code, but this time choose enter details manually. Enter the SMDP plus address and activation code you received in your confirmation email, then tap next. From there, just follow the same steps as with the QR code method. When you arrive at your destination, you only need to do a couple of quick things to connect. Go into Settings, tap Cellular or Mobile Data, and under Cellular Data, make sure your eSIM is selected. Then open your eSIM settings and turn on Data Roaming. That's it, you'll be online and ready to enjoy your travels. With eSIM Circle, staying connected while abroad has never been easier. And if you ever need assistance, just visit us anytime at eSIMCircle.com.